What's up, y'all? I'm back here with another video. I know it's been a while. It's been about shit, man. Last um that brass knuckles review I did, I did that like two weeks ago. So I mean, it's been a while, and um I apologize for that. But um summer just started, so you know I'm gonna be putting out more reviews because I'm gonna have more time on my hands now. But y'all see what I got right here. Got another kingpin. I see I see y'all fucking with the kingpins. Got a, got a nice amount of views on them. Appreciate y'all for that. So um, today I have one of the new ones. These are the new kingpins. This is banana sherbet hybrid. And it's a thousand milligrams. That's a gram. And the total THC this is running in at is 76.88%. And it does have a little bit of CBD running in at 0.33%. CA. I fuck with this. I like the kingpin. I like how he has the red eyes. Because <laughs> he's smacked. And um, I noticed that on the newer ones, the um, sticker is different. If you check out my other two kingpins I did, those were the same boxes. Like it's, It was the same type of box. Um, those had red stickers and the font looked a little bit different as well. This font is different and, um, it was red instead of black. Oh, my bad. Something had fell. My pin had fell. My battery. My bad. All right. And I noticed that on the back, on the older boxes, the ones with the red sticker, the, um, the back was different as well. It didn't, it didn't look anything like this. All it had was um, the um, Best Buy and the data manufacturer and the, um, the batch number. But as you can see, this one is totally different. You can go back on the other vids and see the difference. This one actually has like the, um, the statistics. You see? One three second draw is a single serving, 300 servings. Um, I don't think the other one on, I don't think the other package said that on the back, the 300 servings part. It did say the one three second draw, but it didn't say that about the 300 servings. So I didn't even know that. Banana Sherbert hybrid. You got the strain. Told you about the THC. 7, 6, 7, 6, 8. 8. CBD 3.4. Ingredients, cannabis oil, batch ID. G zero six one five one eight nine H. This was um manufactured on September twentieth, two thousand eighteen. Best by September twentieth, two thousand nineteen. So this was manufactured a while ago. Check it out on the side. Proud to be the most awarded cannabis vape in the world. I did not know that. <laughs> it also says it right there. World's most awarded cannabis vape. All right, so I've already opened this up. I barely got it last night, so I mean, it's still full. Like I noticed on my other reviews, like I kind of smoked them till they were almost done. But this one's pretty much still bad, y'all. I had to, um, I had to cut it. But what was I saying? Um, oh, fuck. Fucking battery just fucking fell on my car. Damn, almost fucking busted my shit. Is it the last table too? That shit could have busted. Y'all know when cars be breaking when you drop them? Yeah. But um, I noticed that they, they have these um tamper resistant seals, which is good. So, you know, like, um, because it's pretty much sealed. But I mean, realistically, like with the fake, somebody could just um, look at that shit. Let me put that shit over there, man. I'm going to fucking bust my card and we're not going to have a fucking review because that's just going to be busted. All right. But it has these tamper resistant seals because this is a real one. This ain't none of that fake shit. But the fake ones, yeah, people could just refill them and just put it back in the package. So, yeah, when you take off those sills, you're going to slide it out. There's going to be a black little cardboard um, like cardboard box thing. And the tube's going to be in there and your card's going to be in the tube. I already have it out, though. Told you, I've been barely using it. Have it on this battery right here. No TH420 box this video. I don't have it with me right now, so I just have this standard one. It has the variable voltage and shit, though. The preheat. It's nice. It doesn't really have a brand. It just has that. It's like a wolf. But yeah, this is a cart. <laughs> Surprised I didn't fucking bust this. There it is. Check it out. Check it out. Kingpin on the glass. Yeah, I know about kingpins on how their carts look. 
Short tips, you already know they changed it up. This is the oil, it's real nice, real nice golden. Um, a lot of people ask for the bubble test, which is good. I think the bubble test is good because it's pretty much, it's showing like whether or not it's cut. Cause like, if I show y'all this right here, look at that, real kingpin shit. None of that fake shit. I don't know if y'all can see that. That shit is not moving at all. Not moving at all. Look at that. Thick ass fucking oil. Fucking fakes. The bubble would have went. All those bubbles at the top would have been at the bottom already. Like literally. So fucking thick. None of that fake shit. If your shit's going all the way down real quick, you gotta get that shit out of here. You smoking on that booth. But um, yeah. All right, it's already on. I'm gonna take a couple hits and um, tell y'all about the flavor. are real nice. I can definitely taste that sherbet. <coughs> and it's sweet. I guess it's like the banana flavor, I guess. Because <coughs> it's banana sherbet. So I can definitely taste the sherbet and it's like sweet. Yeah, I fuck with this. Honestly, because this is preheated too. I preheated this before the vid. Look at that. Still fucking thick. <laughs> I've already, ha I've had this here for like five minutes one time. I just had it down. Shit didn't even move once. It had a bunch of little bubbles in, uh, in the middle. The bubbles literally stayed in the middle the whole time. Like there was like little bubbles right here. And they just stayed there. Didn't even move when it was even, even when it was upside down. But um, this shit tastes like fucking brass knuckles like three, four years ago. When y'all know when brass knuckles was killing the game four years ago? Honestly, this is what this tastes like. So fuck yeah, I'm fucking with Kingpin. This shit's good as fuck. This shit smacks. Hell yeah. I fuck with that flavor, man. That flavor is something different. So um yeah, um <clears throat> I do rem I do recommend this Kingpin banana sherbet hybrid. I do recommend this shit is fucking good. Y'all gotta get it. If y'all see it, get it. So for taste, I would say I'm gonna give my rating on it now. For taste, I would say nine out of ten. I fuck with the taste. Like I said, it has that sherbet taste followed with like a sweet little like a hint of sweet, like I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. It just tastes sweet after you get that sherbet flavor. So, um, consistency. You already saw the consistency. If I had to show it again, I don't mind if I do. Look at that little bubble right there. Look at that bubble in the middle. This is upside down and that's not even moving at all. Look at that. See that bubble right there? For the focus, bubbles aren't even moving at all. So consistency, 10 out of 10. It was the same with my other videos. I don't think I did a bubble test for one of them, but that the consistency with Kingpin is always thick. Like I see people with Kingpins and like that shit is running. Like where are y'all getting y'all shit from? Like <laughs> y'all gotta either, I don't know, y'all gotta find a new connect, man. I'm not gonna throw no names out there cause I'm not like that, but. You can go on YouTube and see the videos for yourself if you need to. So, um, yeah, this shit is good. The only problem is that the oil is so thick that sometimes it gets clogged. And, like, when you're pulling on it, like, you have to, like, keep on pulling on it until, like, the airflow comes on. Because, like, it's clogged. So, like, that's the only problem. Which, I mean, can you complain about thick oil? Not really. Like, that's a good thing. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to do a quick review. Nothing long. Um, shit, I mean, it's been two weeks, man. 
Um, I was waiting to do a review vid, and today was just a day. So, um, yeah, y'all comment, subscribe, like, tell me what, tell me what more y'all want to see. Do y'all do y'all fuck with the kingpins? You want to see more kingpins? I can probably get some other flavors. So, um, yeah. Uh, this has been it. I'll see y'all in the next vid.